All right, in this video, we'll be looking at rewriting logs in the form of an exponential. So on number one, we have the log, log base 7 of 49 is equal to 2. And we're going to rewrite this as a exponential. So the first thing I'm going to need in my exponential is the base. And the base for this one is 7. Here's the base. That base needs an exponent. The exponent in this case is 2. It's this number right here. And it equals to the argument. The argument is 49. Therefore, this log becomes the exponential. 7 squared equals 49. Let's try number 2. Log base 3 of 243 equals 5. We're going to start with the base. The base is right here. That's a 3. That 3 needs an exponent. Here's the exponent 5. And it equals to the argument. The argument is 243. Therefore, we end up with the exponential 3 to the fifth power equals 243. Number 3, we have the log, log base 4 of x equals 9. We're going to rewrite this as an exponential. First thing we need is the base. The base is a 4. That's this right here. That needs an exponent. The exponent is 9. That's this right here. And it equals to the argument. The argument is right here, x. Therefore, we end up with the exponential 4 to the ninth power equals x. All right, let's take a look at a few more examples. Number 4, log base 2 of 64 equals x. We're going to rewrite this as an exponential. So the first thing we need is a base, and that base is a 2. That's this right here. Now we need the exponent. The exponent is right here x, and it equals to the argument. The argument is 64. Therefore, we end up with the exponential 2 to the x power equals 64. Number 5, log base x of 64 equals 2. First, we need the, x, uh, the base. The base this time is x. The exponent is right here, 2. And it equals to the argument. The argument is 64. Therefore, we end up with x squared equals 64. Number 6, let's rewrite that one as an exponential. First thing we need is the base. That's this right here, 64. Now we need the exponents. The exponent is right here, 2. And it equals to the argument. The argument is x. That's this right here. Therefore, we end up with the exponential 64 squared equals x.